folks, Antonio at Osprey Wilds here, talking to you about smelt. Smelts are a small fish that are found all around Minnesota in our lakes. And come springtime when all the ice is off those lakes and our creeks and rivers, those smelts will start running up our creeks and rivers to spawn uh, before uh, sending their babies back down into the lakes. So spawning is just them laying their eggs. Uh, now, smelts are not a native fish to Minnesota. They were introduced. And because of that, they can be not so good for some of our other native fish. So, what do we do to control their population? Well, a lot of folks like me and my friends here, we like to catch them and eat them because they taste pretty good. So let's come back here tonight and take a look at what that process is like. So catch and smelt isn't always that easy when you're using your hands. That's why I brought the net. Oh, dude, they're so slippery. They sure are, Celia. Let's go check in with Alexis. All you really need to go fishing for these are puddle jumper boots, some people wear waders, a net, but you can catch them by hand. Here Julia's going for one and just misses, but we've got faith in her. I bet she, oh, yep, these look like they're gonna be it. There we go, nice job, Julia. Stick it in there. Well, pretty simple process. What else should we know? Alexis, what do you say? That's our head naturalist for you. Thanks, Alexis. The next step is gonna to be to take those fish, clean them, and bring them home so we can cook. Here we are frying up our fish. All we did was breaded it with a little bit of a mix of our own seasonings that we found at home. Mm. What's your review? Delicious. Mm. Seasoning? On point? Perfect. Tenderness? Mm. Great. Awesome. Man, that was a lot of fun, and boy, did they taste good. Remember, if you want to smelt, you need a fishing license. And if the DNR comes around and asks you for it, remember, you got to show them because those who smelt them got to dealt them. Bye-bye now.